Well, good afternoon. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and under the ages of ages. Amen. Uh, so, in the lovely town of Dexa uh, today, again, trying to raise money for the resource center uh, that's up there, just a little ways up. Um, probably can't see it from here, but um, I want to tell you a few stories about old St. Nick, about the real St. Nick. Now, I am a, a Santa's helper. I'm a Banana Claus. Uh, had the distinction of wearing the yellow bandana with the yellow Santa Claus hat because I am his helper. Um, how shall I say? Um, that St. Nick was a real person. He was the Bishop of Myra, St. Nicholas of Myra. And um, he had a reputation for going and leaving socks full of money inside of people's houses at night to uh, help them if they were in need. Uh, so. Where the, we have this uh, thing, we he would put money inside of a sock and drape it on the inside of the window. Here we have it hanging on a chimney of a fireplace. So um, anyway, um, so that's really part of how the tradition came in was uh, that Saint Nicholas would go around leaving money in poor pe people's houses at night. I guess it's where the tradition of him coming down the chimney, because I said probably in the state of Maine he'd have quite a problem because. Uh, a lot of people around now have pellet stoves, so <laughs> could you imagine Santa trying to get down through a three-inch blue pipe and then he gets down inside of the pellet stove and there's an auger in there that feeds the pellets to the flame in there, so that's kind of perilous, I would say. So glory to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. The real Saint Nick did actually hang socks inside of people's houses at night, so just a little bit for your information. Glory to God. 